Here is a Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 4. I'm gonna show you how to screen mirror, wireless screen mirror directly from your Fold 4 to your LG TV. Okay, those will also work similar to other smart TVs as well. Okay, so to get it started, and it doesn't matter if you have the phone closed or open. Okay, so first thing is, well, make sure your TV is on. Next, go ahead and scroll down from the top, bring up the notifications, scroll down again one more time right here. And then what you're looking for is smart view. Samsung calls uh, screen mirroring smart view. Also take note, on the left of there, there is DeX, D-E-X, okay? So you can also use the desktop version, but anyway, this video is about smart view or screen mirroring. If it's not, if smart view is not here, swipe over to the left, okay? Anyway, my smart view is here. So let me tap on that and wait for it to find my TV here. And you can see I have, so I found my LG TV, also found my Samsung TV, but we're gonna use my LG TV on this one. So I'm gonna tap right there and I'm gonna tap on start now. Now the first time that you connect, it's gonna give you a message where you have to accept saying like your Fold 4 wants to connect to this TV and you click on accept, okay? Anyway, you can see that uh, we're you're here mirroring right now. Also take note in regards to the connection, you're not connecting through your home Wi-Fi network, okay? It's actually a direct connection. It's a Wi-Fi di direct, basically using Miracast, okay? However, if you want to um, mirror to the TV and then you want to use the internet to something that requires internet, then it's gonna use the internet from your phone if your phone's connected your, to a Wi-Fi network or it'll use your SIM card, the data from your SIM card, okay? Anyway, and then, also, you know, like I said, we can we can go this way too. We can use it on this screen as well. I'll tap on. And I'll show you my photos gallery here. Oops. Let's go to gallery here and you can see photos here. Of course, you can zoom in and out. Uh, I think I got a video here. The audio is coming out from the TV as well, okay? Now also you have this little floaty thing up here. So if you tap on that, you can disconnect uh, from here and you have other settings on here as well. And if you, you have your settings icon up here as well on the top right hand side, if you tap on that and then you can change your aspect, the aspect ratio as well from here, okay? So I think you guys pretty much got the message here. So if you want to disconnect, you can tap right here onto there. Oops, let me zoom in again and click on disconnect there. Or you can just go back to where it said smart view before. And let's see. So it was, it said smart view before, but now it's the name of my TV. It says LG Web OS. So to disconnect, we can just tap on that as well. And there we go. Pretty simple. Questions or issues, comment below.